The first tier list of 2024, Anon rolled the dice and the dice showed us trees. So we have the trees of old school RuneScape. Uh, so we're going to start off with the first tree. This is the, I believe, golden apple tree from the Fremenic quest line, maybe? I think so, because I don't know what, is it? Where the fuck do you get golden apples? Is this that? I, I don't know, maybe... It's a golden apple tree from somewhere, and it's immediately F tier, because it's completely irrelevant, and I don't know what the fuck it's for. It's from Fremenic, there you go, cool. F tier, because you probably use it once, and it's garbage, and we don't touch it again, thankfully. Garbage tree. Next, we have the dragon fruit tree. This is in no particular order, I'm just grabbing trees as I see them. Dragon fruit tree is an immediate B tier tree, okay, because it's great XP, great fruit. The fruit's limited to the pies, which are good for fletching and also to protect redwood trees, but the seeds, a little bit expensive, the seeds, a little bit hard to come by, and to be honest, nah, well maybe they're A tier then, because you just protect them with coconuts. They're super cheap to protect, which means they don't go shit. Uh, they do take a while to grow, but honestly, great XP. Yeah, they're A tier trees. Dragon fruit, A tier tree. What is this? Is that papaya? Papaya used to be good until dragon fruit came along. It used to be palm and papaya, now it's palm and dragon fruit. Papaya is now a C tier tree, okay? It's an old classic, it's a Hall of Famer, but it's not really important anymore, okay? It's a, it's a tree that we all forgot. Orange tree, garbage, F tier. Pineapple tree, you might not like this opinion, garbage, F tier, shit. Apple tree, absolutely garbage, F tier. These are all shit trees, okay? You don't even need to do these trees because farming is so quick to level that you skip these trees almost immediately. E, no, F tier, not E. Blisterwood tree. I believe the blisterwood tree is actually decent wood cutting SP per hour. Not a bad tree. Honestly, I think it looks fucking sick and the logs are cool. I don't really think there's much other use to it though other than just cutting. <coughs> so I'm going to put it up here at B tier because it is a good wood cutting method. But it's a pretty dead ass tree that doesn't really offer much else. It'd be cool if you can grow your own though, maybe one day with the next, uh, what's it called, the next uh, vampire storyline. Banana tree, these are cool because they're everywhere and you can make money off them as a free to play noob. Very nostalgic. D tier tree. Next we have the, this is the lost city tree where you get your dramon staff. This tree is annoying as shit because uh, especially as a noob, you probably only cut one or two branches and that was it. You want to cut a handful of branches. But the worst part is you have to click the tree every fucking time to cut the branch. Very easy quest. Very easy tree. Annoying as shit to get to because Entrana is full of monks. Which as we know the monks are pedophiles. Therefore D tier tree. Next. Evergreen? Maybe? No. That's the Fremenic Pine Achi tree. No. Pine... Pine... Pine trees? The pine trees. Irrelevant and shit. F tier. What's this? That looks like an oak tree to me. Oak trees are actually really fucking bad. Oak trees are super slow. Have you ever tried starting a brand new account and trying to get to Winnetot as soon as possible? The oak tree is the worst part of that grind. It is fucking horrendous. Oak trees, they fall down too fast. They provide zero forestry experience because they're too low level of a tree for it to really be worth your time. And burning them takes too fucking long to get to Willow. Terrible tree. It goes E tier, okay? But then you've got the willow tree. Willow tree is actually a pretty A tier tree. You can sit at these bad boys forever. They're good fun. Great logs, super practical, good fun, easy, AFK. And the uh, forestry um, event rate is actually not too bad on the forestry worlds at the willows. Plus, the best part about these is this is where the true dark mages killed you as a noob or kills other people as noobs. It wasn't the dark mages outside of Varrock. That's bullshit. When someone's like, oh yeah, when I used to play RuneScape, the dark mages outside Varrock used to kill me. You're a liar. You're full of shit. No, they didn't. The dark mage outside the Drainer Village Bank, those fuckers killed you. These trees are responsible. A tier tree. Love killing people. Evergreens. Fun fact about evergreens. If you use a bucket, if you have a bucket and use a knife on them, you get a bucket of sap. That's about it. D tier tree. I don't know what the fuck this is. So it's immediately going in F tier. Normal trees. Normal trees are good because they're everywhere. They're fun. They're easy. They instantly fall down when you've got like level 10 wood cutting and a decent axe. 
they're very convenient trees. You can't grow them, which is good because I'd be fucking annoying if you could. Um, so that yeah, pretty C tier tree. No problem with them. Pretty decent. Hollow, hollow, hollow tree, hollow tree, hollow tree. The only time I've had to cut this is when I was making split bark armor. Let me tell you something about making split bark armor, especially as an Iron Man. Split bark or um, yeah, I think it was split bark, or even if it's like blood bark and swamp bark and all that stuff. It is the most tedious and fucking annoying process of my life. It is a terrible, terrible process. E tier tree. Because that's the easiest part of the process. I don't know what this is. Looks like some sort of dead tree. If anyone knows what that is, let me know. F tier until then. This is another dead tree, but these are the ones outside Drown Amount that attack you and would scare the absolute living shit out of you. Especially when you are a hardcore with low HP. Or if you were a noob in the early days trying to do the Ernest the Chicken quest and you get fingered by one of these trees as you're walking into the front door. You know, no, nothing scarier than that. Pretty fucking B tier tree. Actually trees, these trees are annoying as shit. These are the ones around the um, ogres for the big chompy bird hunting. Now, fun fact. Fletching these logs gives you a random number of, of shafts between like one and six. The most fucking annoying mechanic in the game. Why the fuck are they, like, every other log gives you a set amount of shafts. These ones are just like, fuck you. So they're F tier. Teak trees, everyone's favorite. Teak trees are good because they're super fast XP and then everyone sits there two, three tick manipulating the trees. And these trees are solely responsible for why wood cutting is not any faster at XP rates than they already are. Therefore, they're B tier trees. Fuck the teak trees. Maple trees are pretty decent. They're like maples, but slightly shit or shitter. So they're gonna go B tier as well. What What is this? Mahogany? Mahogany trees? Mahogany trees are great, great farming XP. That's about it. Oh, and the logs I guess are good for planks. Then teaks are too actually. Maybe teak can go A tier because, tell you what, because of farming XP and the planks, we're gonna move teaks up to A tier and mahogany's gonna sit next to them because they're great. Great trees. I don't think they're S tier. Okay, I think the magic tree, okay, which looks terrible here because of the way the magic tree is, Magic tree is fucking D tier. That shit is garbage. They are so fucking slow. They, they are terrible to cut. Magic trees suck. They suck, especially when they fall over after one log. Most annoying fucking mechanic in the game. It's slightly better now with forestry, but still shit. What the fuck is this? Is that a curry tree? That's an F tier. That, that, is, wor that is worse than F tier. That's the worst fucking tree in the game. That, that is going at the bottom. And that's what people do with tier lists, right? They move... The worst one here. That is the worst fucking tree in the game. Curry tree. Fuck off. Uh, a palm tree. Palm trees are good. Palm trees are great. Palm trees are A tier. Very good trees. Um, we got the spirit tree. Spirit tree, I think, is default S tier. It's the teleportation method that's free, and the one in your house doesn't take up one of your consumables, so it's great, right? Well, yeah. I, I think. I think. Spirit tree has to be S tier, it teleports you. Redwood, I'm gonna go Redwood S tier as well, because S tier is, well, Redwoods are just AFK as fuck. They're, they're just great. I, I, I didn't know how good they were until I started doing it. I think Redwoods are excellent. Super AFK. And what the fuck is this? Where the fuck are U trees? Anon, you, you missed the U tree. Hold on, let me get the U tree out here real quick. Because the yew tree, uh, this is going to be, it's going to sound really biased, but the yew tree is my favorite tree. I think the yew tree is without a doubt S tier. It is, it is an S tier tree. Now, the reason the S tier is one, uh, in the Shazen area on Karend, they look fucking awesome with that really dark, deep red and the darker green. They look fucking beautiful. Yew trees in Prif, excellent for shards, excellent cutting speed. They are, they are what magic trees could be. Or should be, in my opinion. They are the perfect balance of AFK and speed for results out of like logs for XP. They are just excellent. Use best money making on free to play 10 years ago. Actually, they are a free to play tree, aren't they? I think U trees uh, provide a perfect balance of XP and actually banking. You feel like you're accomplishing wood cutting when you're cutting a U tree. I think it is very well balanced, that tree. Uh, this is the, the, the cum cut tree, cow cut tree. Uh, yeah. They're pretty gay. That's a C tier tree, to be honest, because the the little keg it gives you is just annoying, and I don't really want to touch it. 
Redwood is also a big Red, Redwood is a big boy and a lot of XP coming out of him, that's for sure. So um yeah. There we go, boys. That's the tree tier list. My name is King Condor, and if you have a different opinion, you're fucking wrong. The Hespori should be on the list, but he wasn't, and I forgot about him. And I didn't make the tier list, so we're just gonna pretend like he wasn't there. Aren't Willow's S tier because they killed a few high crime men? Yeah, but the shit. What about mushroom trees? All right, look, not every tree is going to be on the tree tier list. And you know why? People make mistakes, all right? We're only human. If the tree isn't on the tier list, it didn't make the cut, maybe it will next time. I'm sorry, I don't make the tier list. I just get handed them, and then I do them, and then shift blame. Mushrooms would probably be B tier, and um, Hespori would probably be A tier. Not S, no, yeah, S tier. Hespori gives the, it's, it's a fight, it's fun. This is the easiest room in the raid. It's quite simple. You got a big boy. Look at him, god damn! Fuck, mate, look at that boy. It's huge! You got a big boy.